This will be a simple tutorial on how to create a simple Fog of War system in Godot. This is good for RTS games or maybe like a top-down shooter where you want things to be hidden. There are a few adjustments that should be made, but for the purposes of an RTS game, this works just fine. So for a simple scene overview, I just have a mesh instance and it's just set to a cube. And I have a material on it that's green and this really doesn't affect the tutorial. And then I have a area node that is actually an important part and I just have it connected to the script. And then I have a sphere collision shape that is the collision area for that area. And then I have just another mesh instance just for visual. And then the enemy, I have a simple path here. It's just a path that runs through the fog of war and then it will restart. And then I have a enemy node. This is just a path follow. I have a visual, and then I have a kinematic body with a collision shape. The kinematic body is very important. So let's actually get into the script. So that area node we created for the friendly, I just hooked that up to the script for both the body entered and the body exited. And then I just do a simple is in group check. So I can just go to that kinematic body and just check the groups and it says enemy. So I can just do a simple group check and then on the body entered i can just say body dot get parent dot show so we get the parent of this kinematic body which is the path follow if you're just having the kinematic body then you could just say body dot show and then for the on area body exited i can just say body dot get parent dot hide once again if it's just the kinematic body you can just say body dot hide so that's pretty much it for the simple fog of war script and for the enemy script it's just adding some offset over time to follow the path and then i can run the code and we can see that the enemy follows the path i actually forgot to turn the enemy back off but whenever it exits that vision radius it will hide itself again and whenever it enters it will show itself so you can make some improvements to this by adding an extra raycast check just to make sure that the enemy isn't behind any walls. You could also you could also make this shape a cone instead of a sphere. You can just go to collision polygon and then you can just set the shape in there to get the cone shape that you want. But that's pretty much it for this simple fog of war script. Uh, once again, improvements can and most likely are not should be made to the script, but for a simple script, it's pretty decent and it works just fine. So thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. It helps out the channel. It helps get content like this recommended to others. Thanks for watching. Fun